everyone, BBA aka Bamboozled by Anime here with my first full length commentary for Call of Duty Black Ops. It's been a while I know since I've done some commentary, but I have a reason to do commentary now on a new computer. This computer actually is a lot more powerful than my old one. My old one couldn't really handle uh, what I was trying to accomplish, so I decided during Black Friday that I go out and buy a new one, and I wound up with a 500 gigabyte hard drive computer compared to my old 120 gigabyte computer. So you know that for sure I can definitely do more than what I was trying to do. So now that I've got that set and out of the way, I can start uploading matches again like I usually was. And start off, I figured I'd go with Black Ops. Now I know some of you guys who subscribed hopped on board the Halo Freight Train and while Halo Reach is a good game, better than the rest, I have to say, than the other Halos I played, I really don't like it as much. I'm a Call of Duty fanboy, so meh, suck it. And also, I left off at the credits tutorial videos. I had put two out, and I had said I was going to do a Grunt Apocalypse or sniping match in particular. I don't know, because it's been so long since I've been played. And I put that on high disk because of all the updates that Bungie was doing. And really, after thinking it over, there's no point for me to try to do it. People have already put up videos besides what I put up for earning credits fast. And you're really probably just better off looking at those videos. So I'm just going to stick to my guns here and just upload videos whenever, however I feel like. And in this match in particular, this was a Mercenary Team Deathmatch. I really wanted to do just a 30 second clip for what happened in this, but because I started laughing so much throughout the whole match, you know, where you're like, oh my god, no way, this just happened, what? You get in that heat of the moment, and I think, what the hell, I might as well just upload it. And it's not some crazy, super good, badass video like you'd see some of the Machinima guys do, but I do go 30 and 5, and I get uh, 6.0 KD. And I'll let you guys view my description for the setup for what I was using. But you can see here that I'm using the foul, which is not what I typically run with. Usually, if I can, I go with the AK-74 or the, uh, no, AK-47 assault rifle, excuse me, or the commando when I get higher leveled up. So this is like a new experience for me, but I'm playing on firing range, and I'm getting used to it testing it out with what setup I'm running. To me the foul, because of its uh, ability to just pop, 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 it's a slower paced gun so I want to pace myself as a play as opposed to the other guns like the AK-47 where you can just go full auto and run around and kill whatever. I feel like I can just slow down, take the spots I want to, pick the enemy off, move on. And with my secondary weapon dual wielding pythons, that enables me to handle the up close and personal things that can happen. I may get face planted a couple times, trying to hip fire away if I can using the foul or knife, because you know commando is apparently present in this, but everybody has it this time. Anyway, <laughs> uh, I'm on a streak here, and I'm as you see, I move around, try to find out where somebody is, sit down. Oh, there's a guy. Turn around. I'm trying to get my bases down, and of course, I see the enemies on the map here. It's like, hmm, let's just wait here. Oh, there they go. Except I was really expecting one. And there's a third. Wow. And then, of course, a fourth. Uh, why did my like how I got past, you know? <laughs> You're on a streak, and then you see, oh, there's a guy, there's a guy, there's a guy. Come on, come on. You can't kill me. And all of a sudden, you get and then you see immediately after the guy dies. What the fuck? So anyways, I start over and I'm walking up here. Ooh, okay, well, let's call it a napalm. I'm safe right here. Now watch what happens here. This is what I was thinking to do a 30 second clip, but it was too long. Guy runs past me, so I start chasing after him after calling the napalm. Get him, and look what I pop up with the napalm. One, two, three, four, and then a random fifth guy. That was all six of them, and then the two that immediately respawned after they got killed by the napalm come running up and get hit fired by my foul. Holy shit! So yeah, I I'm feeling invincible right now. I come in here, gun blazing, hip fire, and everything. Thinking, must get the kill. No! And of course, I get killed from behind. And I was trying to bring out my pythons, but fuck that. I didn't get to do it. 
But yeah, that, uh, that, that adrenaline and rush really felt good there. So now I'm starting to try to run out off of something because I'm like, oh, I'm on the top of the boards here. I got the highest score. Look what just happened to me. So I got to try to slow myself back down, get out of the adrenaline mode because I'm trying to rush back in. I can't do that with this gun. I like rushing. I like getting in there. I like the firefights, but I can't do that with this. So I have to slow down again. And I saw that guy, and I was like, okay, he went down. Let's go down here just in case somebody comes, because I don't have a suppressor on this gun. And, well, let's toss a decoy in there, get him distracted. Let's see if he's not there again. Oh, he is there. Peekaboo. This time I, was, I decided to throw a decoy. Pop! The only reason I threw a decoy is because I recently watched a video on YouTube showing a guy actually dying from a decoy directly impacting him from bouncing around on the ground. So I figured, okay, if that can happen, why not just throw a decoy to a guy that's just across the map from me? And sure enough, I get it. But of course, the guy was in last stand, so I got the kill for that easily. In the same position as it was before, except this time I'm bringing out the pythons like I should have before. Get the one kill. I was expecting the other guy to be coming around, but apparently he didn't even bother watching his radar. So I was like, okay, let's see what's going on. Oh, there's a guy. Hell, Tomahawk! And pick off two kills. I was like, oh no, scoreboard! Got my napalm! What? We're losing! Yeah, they called him real quick. And then, yeah, I call them, watch what happens. Mm -hmm. Epic win. 7500 to 7400. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that as much as I did. And please watch out for more videos. Thanks.